Hello everyone and welcome back to another video. So this is going to be teaching all of you how to create a fling player command. So basically, let's say you type in chat slash fl fling player name and that player flings. That's exactly what I'm going to teach you. This only takes one script and it's only about like 20 lines of code and it's uh, just like really simple. So uh, let's get into it. So first in service script service, you want to insert a script and let's just call this like fling command, something like that. Yeah, fling command. Okay, so now we're just gonna start off with local admins equals to. So these will be, uh, these admins will be the people who will be able to use these commands. So I'll just put my uh, username in there, and then uh, you could just put your username in there if you want to. So those will be the admin names. So now we're gonna do game dot players. Oops, not place ID dot player added connect. Nope, not once. Connect function, and then player. Now we're gonna do if table are fine. No, why is it auto? Okay, so if table are fine, so this player will be admins table. The table is admins, and then player dot name. So it's looking into this table for your username. Then, so if it finds it, uh, what did I do wrong? Oh, this has to be cur curly brackets. My bad. Uh, this admin. Okay, curly brackets. So if table dot find admins player dot name. So if they find your name in the admins, then player dot chatted connect function. And then this will be uh, a message. And uh, guys, uh, the reason why uh, my thing is like uh, my studio is auto like auto selecting the wrong X code is because I just got a new computer. So just don't mind that. So now we're gonna do local split string no split message equals to string dot split message comma space. So what we'll do, we'll s split what you said. So if you're saying slash fling, uh, no, slash fling space a player's name, then it will split it between the slash fling and the player's name with this space, okay? Simple as that. Now we're gonna do if split message and then straight brackets one equals equals two, and then this will be your command. So I'm gonna do dot fling, okay? And game dot players, find first child, split message, bracket a straight brackets two so it's looking if the first part is dot fling and the second is a player's name that is in the server so if that is true then it's going to be local player to fling equals to game dot players five first child split message brackets two just like that and now we're going to do a uh, if player to fling dot character and no and player to fling dot character dot humanoid root part then so if the player has to do the root, root part then local velocity equals to instance dot new body velocity just like that then we're gonna do velocity dot velocity equals to uh, let's just do like vector 3 dot new dot new and then let's just do like 500 comma 250 comma 0 something like that and then velocity dot max force equals to vector three dot new mat dot huge comma mat dot huge comma mat dot huge. So this will just make the velocity just auto act on the player. And then velocity dot parent equals to player dot character dot no not player dot player to fling dot character dot humanoid report. And then after weight point two five. If velocity, then velocity destroy. And this is it, guys. This is it. That's all you have to do. So let's see if this uh, works. So I'm gonna go into this game and let's see if it works. So as you can see, I'm right here. Why? I'm okay. As you can see, I'm right here. So now let's see. So I'm gonna do dot fling. So let's see. if I do a random username, nothing's gonna work. But let's say I do dot fling hashtag blue underscore yt. As you can see, I get flung really far from the spot. And uh, it worked. So uh, that's pretty much it. So uh, this script will be in the description. And uh, that's it, guys. Hope you enjoyed. Be sure to like, subscribe, and turn on notifications. Bye.